It's sunny outside. Look. You can't, it's so bright you can't even tell. Look how nice that is. And the pool is getting cleaned. That's very exciting. It's all tuned up. Summer is coming. So I'm super excited. We have been waiting for, oh, by the way, remember the new hire? Remember, remember that little thing we did about the new hire? There he is. Right here. There's the new hire, yep. Mr. Hudson Sanders. Yep. You can follow him on Instagram. Hudson.Sanders on Instagram. There we go. All right, it's enough Hudson. <laughs> so we have been waiting to film something that is very exciting to me, uh, but we've been, it's been what? Like a week and a half of just rain and cold here? Like complete straight up winter. We've been just waiting for like a nice sunny warm day to do this. So today is the day, which means we don't get to be in the office a lot. Gotta go. All right, it's time. So it's still your, sunny. Your video is gone with your face. Every time I'm trying to film something. You need to turn on the on the air button. We don't have an. That's a great idea. Get an on the air light. Mm -hmm. And then if anybody talks, then you dock their pay. <laughs> Can I dock your pay as an owner? I feel like I do dock your pay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So as I was saying, electric skateboard. These guys from WowGo sent me this and it's been sitting here for a week. Well, one, we were in Virginia Beach. I had to do like the little speaking thing. So it's been sitting here and then we've had horrible, horrible weather the entire time. But now it's time to do the unboxing. And I'm catch. All right, because the table, because we're gonna go out, actually test this thing out. We have all our gear laid out, so we're just gonna do it right here on the floor. We're just gonna ah, fragile. It must be Italian. Not working very well. All right, manual. Don't need that. No, we probably won't need that actually. <laughs> the blinking light. Oh, a holder. Oh, these are pads. Remote, pads. Oh, heavy duty, that's for sure. What is that? I'm stoked. Light, charger, truck tool, instructions. Oh, that's kind of cool. Tool inside of a tool. Screws, remote, and hanger. All right, 38 kilometers an hour. 23.6 miles per hour. 23.6 miles an hour. <laughs> First, we're gonna do a parking lot test, and then we're gonna charge it, and then we're gonna go to the beach and ride it down on the beach. All of a sudden, got a little nervous. <laughs> All right, let's give this thing a go. I think the batteries are definitely low because I feel like that's 20, what do you say, 23 miles per hour? 26. 26, so out the box, it works, but I think I think it's got more go. I think we need to tighten it up. You you need to try it? I think it's the trucks are really loose. There's a lot of... No, no, I mean, I can just tighten it. It comes with a tool. Oh man, those are really loose. Right? Yeah. Like, that's a lot, man. especially if you're going really I'm fast. I'm not used to that, but... You know? Yeah, if you're making tight turns, that's not good. Yeah. We're going fast. All right. All right. All right. All right, Hudson. Oh, we went back foot first. Yeah. Go get him. Bye. Bye, Hudson. Bye. Bye. Four, four something? That's the cheapest one. Yeah, boosted boards 1500 and then the Spitfire I think is 1200. Wait a minute, how did I end up with the camera? <laughs> Thought I hired somebody. Verdict from a 17 year old. Awesome. 
<laughs> is it? Yeah, that's cool. Right, so we need, we're gonna tighten up the trucks, we're gonna charge the battery, and then we're going to the beach. Charged, fast, really fast charge too, wasn't it? Yeah, that was like what? 30 minutes? Yeah. Not even? So one thing that we thought about is you don't have an external battery, so if you travel with it, you need to travel with your charging cord or um, have a second charging cord for like your backpack and then a home station. That might be pretty common with electric skateboards. I don't know, just something that we thought about. I think we should just test like the distance of this thing. Yeah. How, how many? Run? Yeah, I think we should do, well, we'll do a bunch of runs, but I think we should really, let's just go until the battery dies. Yeah. Cool? Cool. We'll roll. Runs, everything's pretty good. I would say it's not as fast as I thought. It's not so fast that I'm scared. Like I'm, yeah. I think that the videos of me getting pulled by Leo are are fast. Yeah. So sorry to interrupt this this video, but I had to kind of update it because while I was away for work this weekend, Hudson found out that there's modes on here and. This board goes a lot faster, like dangerously faster than what I thought. So this little button here, can you see that? Let's focus on that right there. Let's get it. So like if you push this, see that's the slow mode. Push it again, medium, that's like fun mode. And this is like, you're gonna die mode. See the four blinking lights? So. 400 something bucks. This board goes really fast. We've got our straightaway plan. Okay, go! good. It goes really fast. We dig it. Enjoy the rest of the video. Me getting pulled by Leo are, are faster. Yeah, but it's consistent and it's smooth and I'm digging it. So now we're going to drive, we're going to ride all the way down to Coors and get a snack, which, which is 20 kilometers, which means it should die. not doing 20 miles an hour but that might be because I'm doing I'm 200 pounds still super super fun I think we're about halfway there it might be slowing down just a little bit but we're still good That's 10 kilometers. 
back the other way. Let's see how far we can make it. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> All right, well the update is, Cora, you're closed. Just on one case. I didn't know. I didn't know that you were closed. The board has not died yet. It's you're in the you're in the way of the board. Yeah, sorry. Scabber, get out of the way. It's look, it's still alive. Come back here. There we go. So um Okay, it's still alive, so we're gonna go back the other way. All right, I think we've finally killed it. We're down to our last little blinking dot, but we're coming to a screeching halt. Before can we get out of it? I've got it floored and we're coming to a halt. This thing is given everything it's got. It did, it did good. It did, we're down a person. Yeah, she's up ahead, we gotta grab her. Oh, jeez. okay. Okay, all in all, I'm impressed. We did almost 20K, just shy of it, and we rode for about two hours straight. The last, I would say, 15 minutes, we were like blinking on the little one bar, and it started slow, and it just finally slowly died. But overall, very, very awesome experience. Um, I'm gonna be riding this thing a lot. Now, what I will say is, the other two electric boards that I know are the Boosted Board and the Coda Longboards Spitfire 2. I've ridden the Coda Longboard Spitfire 2, and it was awesome. I, had, I did not ride it to the extent that I rode the WowGo, but I will say that for the money, this has, I think that they're gonna do really, really well because they have, this board I think was, what did we say, 400? Four something, yeah. 425 or something like that. Then they've got another one that is like three something and they've got another one that's like 285. Um, so you can just wanna like, if you wanna like bomb around your neighborhood with your kids or your dog, like, and not drop $1,500 or $1,200 on a board, like definitely the way to go. I mean, what do you think? Yeah, for sure. It's, like for 400 bucks? Yeah, 400 bucks is nothing compared to like some of the other prices. For now, boards. I will say eventually I probably will have both those other boards, but this is definitely getting hung up and uh, I'll probably buy another charger for it. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, thanks, WowGo. That was super fun. And now this is going to get hung up in the office on the wall for daily use probably. Yeah. So Hud so Hud's can can, yeah. can use it as well. And that's the end of the vlog. Never quit, never surrender. We'll see you guys next time.